The History of Rideau Public School Rideau Public School was originally located on the corner of Nelson and Princess Streets in 1924 as a two-story schoolhouse, but it moved to Dundas and McDonnell Streets in 1926 as a three-story building. The first principal of Rideau Public School was Miss E. Wilder. The school cost $106,700 to build. These are the names of the principals with big impacts. Miss E. Wilder, the principal in 1926, and Mr. Greg Severett, the principal now, who just like all the other, other principals, stood out. But someone who stood out the most was Mr. H. Jackson, who brought sports to the school, made a school crest and motto, They Can Who Think They Can, in 1946, which made a big impact on the school curriculum. Sports were a big factor in 1946 when Mr. H. Jackson was at Rideau. In 1946, Rideau had a softball team, a soccer team, and a hockey team who made the semifinals of the tournament. Now the school has a soccer team, basketball team, running team, robotics team, and a chess team, and a volleyball team. Hey everybody, do you know Don Cherry? Yeah, the guy who coached the Boston Bruins for a long time. Well, he went to Rideau Public School for his education also, and he played on the school hockey team for his entire time at Rideau. Back in 1926, boys and girls had to be separated. There was a boys' entrance and a girls' entrance to separate them. Hidden doors separated the boys and the girls inside the school. Currently, the boys' entrance is the doorway on the west side of the school near the portables, and the girls' entrance is on the east side of the school, near the parking lot. There have been lots of changes from start to finish. One main one is the field that has changed from grass to turf. They've added an extension of the grade one slash kindergarten hallways. They have kept the original limestone arch at the front entrance. The ceiling and the main frames stayed the same. Mr. Lapp built a hockey rink every year, and all the people in the community would come around and skate together. Lido Public School is a great place to learn. It brought out one of the best coaches in hockey, experienced new changes to this school, educated thousands of students, and still remains the oldest elementary school in the Aldous Beach.